diagonals that bisect each other. So bisect means two equal parts. So those two would be congruent to each other. And then these two would be congruent to each other. Right there and right there. And then we can set up equations. We'll start with the red equation. So y is going to equal 3x plus 1 is one of our relationships we can set up. And our second relationship then is uh, uh, y plus 15 equals 5x. And then we would check both equations. So that's all we can do as far as setting up some equalities. Then we would check both equations and see is there any of these equations that I could solve out for a missing variable. And there's not because both equations have two different variables, which we can't solve then for, for one of those variables. So what I'm going to do then is I'm going to use substitution. So we're going to use the equations working together to get an equation with all the same variable. So I'm going to take that y is equal to 3x plus 1, and I'm going to put that in for y right there, which is going to give me this, 3x plus 1 plus 15 is going to equal 5x. So I've taken the y out, and I'm just going to put parentheses around. I don't need to do this in this case, but I'm going to put parentheses around just to show that's where y used to be, and now it becomes 3x plus 1, because y and 3x plus 1 are the same thing. Then we're left with 3x plus 16 is equal to 5x, and we'll get 3x moved over. 16 is equal to 2x, which gives me x equal to 8. So x is equal to 8. And then from there, once I know that x is equal to 8, I could put it into either equation. I'm going to use the red one, though, because the red one is 3 times 8 plus 1, which is going to be 25. So then my y is going to equal 25. So there would be my two variables. x is equal to 8. Once you know x, you can go back and find y. y would be then 25. So hopefully that helps, but anytime you get two equations that both equations have different variables, you have to get into using a system of equations, which we'll, we'll be able to use substitution in all of our problems in geometry.